Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Planet Mars here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a tight bun on 4C hair and how to slick your edges down. So let's get into it. First, you want to spray water all over your hair so you can comb through it and brush your hair very easily because, mind you, I have 4C hair and it can be very difficult if it's dry. And next thing I'm going to do is brush through it and kind of use a pick as well because I want it to make the bun fuller. So this will help the process. I didn't pick my whole head, mind you, or the back, but I just wanted the front to be the most poofiest. Now it's time for me to try to put this thick hair into a ponytail, which this is probably the worst part because my arms get tired and it's sometimes very annoying. But anywho, now I'm going to put Eco Styling Gel on my edges to get that slick look we are looking for. So what I'm going to try to do now is rub the gel onto my edges so I can get that slick look that I'm wanting because as you guys know my hair is 4C so sometimes my hair has a tendency to look more matte than slick so this should help and make sure you guys rub it on the back as well. <laughs> just gonna pick out my puff so it can be a little bigger slay those baby hairs guys you know I love my edges but if you have weak edges try to be gentle with it because I've been having problems with my edges a little bit, but we want to keep our edges, so just be very careful when you're brushing them.
I hope you guys liked my video in this bun look. I really enjoyed it. It's a good summer hairstyle, also a good fall hairstyle. If you don't like doing nothing to your hair and you just woke up, it's an easy style. So that's all you need is make sure you use like this Eco Styler Gel right here. It's really good for your edges. And a toothbrush or whatever you use, you can use a spoolie tube, which I don't use. I use these on my eyebrows. But yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe on the bottom. And See y'all next time.